Hello, everyone. It's August 13th. Nope, it's August 12th. Sorry, I'm a day ahead. August 12th, 2012. I'm Dwight Schmuck. This is the Schmuck Look. Today, we're going to talk again about some governmental officials and alleged adults who damn well ought to know better, but are too chicken shit to do the right things. I'm addressing those wonderful officials in North Haven, Connecticut. There was a story in yesterday's Brattleboro Reformer. Go to www.reformer.com or, you know, just Google this anyway. Little seven-year-old girl, the, the town of North Haven, Connecticut, has ordered this seven-year-old girl to get rid of her bunny rabbit pet, her pet bunny rabbit, because they don't have the requisite two acres of ground that you need to have a pet rabbit in North Haven, Connecticut. Now, what's happened here? I've Googled this, and, you know, I've read several stories on it. What really has happened here is the neighbors are pissed off at, uh, what's the guy's name here, Josh Lidsky, because his property is blighted. There's some siding missing on his house. They don't like the rabbit hutch being outside. You know, little stuff. But the neighbors are pissy. So they alerted the town, and they, the town sent out an inspector. And the inspector, rather than issue warnings or citations or whatever to Josh Lidsky, because it's his property that's in disrepair, issued an order that, you know, you got to get rid of the bunny. Bunny's got to go. You don't have two acres. Bunny got to go. Now, the town has said, no, 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 no. We don't really want to get rid of the bunny. We just want him to come in and get a variance to the code. El Toro Poo Poo. It's a seven-year-old girl's pet. Do you have an ordinance about Rottweilers, perhaps? Oh, how about German Shepherds? Doberman Pinchers, I know. How about squirrels? Or those rats with wings? Pigeons? My God, people, it's a seven-year-old girl and her pet. What has this country come to? Huh? Are you scared to go after the guy? Pick on his daughter. That'll promote you. Yeah, that'll make him get the house fixed up. Damn it! You're supposed to be better than that. I am so glad I'm old. I don't have to put up with this nonsense too damn many more years. But my God, people. You're supposed to be better than that. But North Haven, Connecticut is home to a lot of elites. And we wouldn't want to spoil their property values even a little bit, would we? So let's pick on a little girl. Yeah, that'll show how tough and rough we are. My God in heaven. The cop from Kalamazoo in Calgary, and now this on the East Coast. Oh, my dear word. Like I said, I'm glad I'm old. I am so damn glad I'm old. By the way, I've got a new subscriber, and if you give me just a second here, I'll pull up the guy's name. I do want to thank you for subscribing. I do appreciate it. I really do. <coughs> this, 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 folks, is the kind of nonsense that really, really, really pisses me off. Don't go after the guy in question. Let's pick on his daughter, because that'll make everything wonderful. Okay, Merrick NR, thank you so much for subscribing to the Schmuck Look. I appreciate it. Your comments will be appreciated too. Folks, email North Haven, Connecticut. And I mean ultra email them. Pass this to your buddies, your friends, anybody you know who likes to give a goose, so to speak. Tie up their damn computers with emails. 
straighten this shit out ourselves. It's really time we the people took some action. And there's a good way. They have to read every email. That's going to cost them more money than, than this whole thing. It could have been avoided. Adult to adult, it could have been fixed. But no, let's pick on a kid. You're supposed to be better than that. I'm Dwight Schmuck. That's the Schmuck look. Peace out there.